DNA testing, also known as DNA analysis or DNA profiling, is a process used to identify individuals or determine biological relationships based on their genetic information. Here's a simplified explanation of how DNA testing works. Sample collection. The process begins with the collection of biological samples containing DNA. Common sources of DNA samples include saliva, blood, hair follicles, skin cells, and buccal cheek swabs. Samples are collected using swabs, collection kits, or other non-invasive methods. Isolation of DNA. Once the samples are collected, the DNA must be extracted and isolated from other cellular components. This is typically done using chemical or mechanical methods to break open the cells and release the DNA. DNA amplification. In many cases, the amount of DNA obtained from the sample is too small for analysis. To overcome this limitation, a process called polymerase chain reaction, PCR, is used to amplify or make copies of specific regions of the DNA. PCR involves cycles of heating and cooling to replicate the DNA in vitro. DNA analysis, the amplified DNA is then analyzed using various techniques such as gel electrophoresis, capillary electrophoresis, or next-generation sequencing, NGS. These techniques allow researchers to examine the DNA's structure, size, and sequence. DNA profiling in forensic DNA testing and paternity testing, specific regions of the DNA known as short tandem repeats, STRs, or microsatellites are analyzed. These regions contain repeating sequences of nucleotides, and the number of repeats can vary between individuals. By comparing the number of repeats at multiple STR loci between different samples, it is possible to create a unique DNA profile for each individual. Data interpretation. The DNA profiles obtained from the samples are then compared and analyzed to determine relationships or identify individuals. In forensic applications, DNA profiles from crime scene evidence can be compared to profiles from suspects or DNA databases to establish links or identify perpetrators. In paternity testing, the DNA profiles of the alleged father, mother, and child are compared to determine biological parentage. Quality control and reporting. Throughout the DNA testing process, quality control measures are implemented to ensure accuracy and reliability. Once the analysis is complete, the results are interpreted by trained analysts and reported to the relevant parties, such as law enforcement agencies, courts, or individuals seeking paternity confirmation. Overall, DNA testing is a powerful tool for identifying individuals, establishing relationships, solving crimes, and providing insights into genetic traits and predispositions. It relies on a combination of sample collection, DNA isolation, amplification analysis, and interpretation techniques to generate meaningful results.